King of hospitality, come greet ya. He's always with a smile, cause he pleased to meet ya. He keeping it 100, he keeping it peaceful. The question is the name of the show. Damn your people. You got the word, let the whole world know. Damn your people. Life's a party, man, y'all welcome to go. Community is family, that's how we grow. When the king of hospitality step your way, he just want to know what everybody got to say. Talk and laugh to go a long, long way. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. People by the people TV. Every week some TLC, TYP. Bring laughter to smiles and joy your night. One touch from the wand, it might change your life. When the king of hospitality says thank you, he not being funny, he just being grateful. He know you know what time it is when you hear this song. You better get your people's them your people's is on. Okay? <laughs> okay. 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 Hey, it's Mr. Gary, the king of hospitality. I'm here at Harris Stowe State University. But you know what? I got a backdrop. I got some background people. The background people are called the people from Mississippi. Who do I have with me? Milton Williams. Mr. Milton Williams, Men United. Yes, what right. is it all about? You all in Mississippi? Y'all not? Yes, not. sir. Yes, sir. Absolutely. We are, we're in Mississippi, the Magnolia State. Yeah, 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 yeah. The Southern hospitality. You're the king of hospitality. Yeah, yeah. We the Southern hospitality. Okay, okay. And so you all... Brought some students to St. Louis for what? Yes, sir, absolutely. Well, we are uh, our goal here, at Men United and Community Connectors, is to get the students uh, the resources and leadership skills needed to develop mm -hmm. men to be a effective leader in the community. So uh, we thank God for uh, Harrisville State University for giving us the opportunity to uh, let our children give our children the resources and tools they need up here to expand their education and knowledge. Oh my God, it's about expanding education. It's about expanding knowledge. It's about getting the people to get up. Like Betty Thompson said, stand up. Wake up, be up, pay up. And if you can't do that, then just shut up. That's exactly right. We shutting the door, we shutting it down on education. They are on the bus. They've come to St. Louis to see what Harris Stowe has to offer. Now, what I get to do is I get to travel around these parts all over the United States. I get to go to places like Mississippi, and I get to say, hey, guess what? On behalf of Harris Stowe State University, this is a good place to come bring your students. And guess what? Y'all listen, y'all about students, y'all deep, what's uh, up? Yes, sir. Hey, it's about, uh, we, we brought a bunch of people from uh, Charleston, Mississippi, Quitman County, and uh, some of our sur other surrounding areas yeah. that's in our program. Uh, so it's awesome that they all decided to come out and uh, that they actually, you know what I'm saying, we, we talked with them and they, and they was on board 100% right away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How important uh, so, is education? Uh, very important, yeah. very important. Uh, yeah. I, I, I want a big school guy, but um, I realized that it was really no way around it and I had to get involved with school. And I started taking the series once I got to universities and JUCOs and stuff like that. Um, okay. So it's very important. Um, What's your name? Lee Williams. Mr. Lee Williams? Yes, sir. Who's that over there, Lee Williams? Hey, this right here is Mr. Robert Miller II. Mr. Robert Miller II. <laughs> yes, sir. So you know down in Mississippi, some of y'all know about the people in Mississippi. Y'all know your people, L.C., J. Reed, and, and T.C., and all them names that just had an initial to it. Now, what's your name again? Uh, Robert Miller II. Uh, Robert Miller II. Are you R.M.? Uh, yeah, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Robert, yes, sir. what does it mean for you to be a chaperone and be here with the young people? Uh, it's, a, it's a great honor to be uh, on this trip to bring these young kids up from Mississippi to St. Louis to visit the college. Uh, a lot of our guys and men united uh, are yearning for another opportunity yeah. to, uh, you know, pursue after high school. So this is yeah. a great opportunity that was presented and they know how important education is because we know a terrible a mind is a terrible thing to waste. I tell you what, a mind is a terrible thing to waste. I tell you something else is a terrible thing to waste. A good plate of food. If ever you wanted to get some good food, you got to go to Mississippi. They got the best greens, beans, tomatoes. Or you name it, they got it. Who do I have with me? Uh, my name is Shaquita Prince. I'm uh, Shaquita. There ain't no Mississippi name Shaquita. Yeah. Uh, that's a city name, girl. <laughs> <laughs> what does it mean for you? You're with the young ladies. You all have a, a lot of young girls that's out. How important is it that they understand that it is not just about when you become a senior, getting good grades. I think it's very important because in the long run, then they'll know, you know, what exactly it is that they want to do in the future. Mm -hmm. And it was just a blessing for me to be able to join Men United because I have my mentoring program, which is Exquisite Pearls of Excellence, that we were able to bring some of the girls here oh, as well. Yeah. So Exquisite Pearls, and I'm seeing you in pink and green, that yes, sounds I'm like something both has both. to do something with the ladies of Alpha, Kappa Well, no, Alpha. it's a mentoring, group, a mentoring group that we have for ninth through 12th graders for high school students, and okay. I'm just representing both. Okay, just representing both. Who's yeah. over here? 
Uh, my name is Beverly Taylor. Okay. I also uh, I teach these students college and career readiness at Charleston High School. Okay. So I'm excited for them to be able to get exposure to colleges outside of Mississippi. All right. I tell you what, it's about the exposure. It's about college. It's about you preparing your students. You got to do it when they start off young. From the kindergarten, if you send sending your child to kindergarten, they don't know their name, it's a problem. If you're sending your child to the first grade, they can't count to one, two, three, four, five, it's another problem. But if you hit the second grade and you don't know your A, B, C, D, E, F, Gs, and I'm not talking about the alphabet song. Can y'all sing the alphabet song with me? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T. Remix, remix, stop it. If your child is saying, I know my ABCs, and they start singing the ABC song, they don't know they ain't the alphabets. They know the ABC song. Hey, what do you say? What he says, Mr. Gary, let's get in here and see what this educational experience is about for the Mississippi students is all about. Okay? <laughs> okay. What do you say what he say? It's Mr. Gary. It's all about the excitement. It all comes down to this. Mississippi, make some noise! Oh my God, look at the students from Mississippi. Oh my God. Okay, Mr. Williams, so guess what? You came to St. Louis, you saw Harris though, you met the president. What did you think? Look here, I'm, I'm just excited. I love uh, President Smith here. We are uh, excited for the scholarship the students have received. We're excited for the opportunity. President Smith, you told this gentleman, you said, I need you to get the students to think about Harris Stowe. Why? That's because Harris Stowe, Mr. Geary, I share with you all the time, Harris Stowe is a gem in the St. Louis crown. And we are the most affordable, accessible, and diverse college here in the, in the state of Missouri. Wow. And so we are so excited because we are committed to our mission of making sure that we provide a quality education for those who may be under-resourced, underserved, and also underprepared. Well, I tell you what, you know your people. Now, these students said, we're going to go to St. Louis. We're from Mississippi, and we want some scholarship. Now, you promised, Ms. President, Madam President, you said if they come, we're going to look at their grades, and we're going to give out some scholarships. Is that what you said? Absolutely. Is I that... said that in July, okay. and so they're here today. Okay. And so we have scholarships. Well, do you have scholarships? Yeah, we have scholarship recipients, too. We've awarded scholarships. Oh, my... No, you... Like yeah. these students here, yes, the ones from Mississippi. Yes, so just like someone who's watching television right now, they may have some students, they may be thinking about coming to school. There's scholarship money available, is that right? There is scholarship money available here at Harris Stowe State University. And we're just asking individuals to reach out to us. You can visit us on our website, www.hssu.edu, or hmm. you can call us at 314-340-3366. Well, you know what, Mississippians, what is Mississippi the state of what? Magnolia State. The Magnolia yes. State. Well, I want y'all to know right now, y'all in the show me state. Y'all in the show me state. So you know what I need you to do? I need you to show me the money. I need you to show me some scholarships. If you got some scholarship recipients, where they at? Where they at? Okay. If you got a scholarship, go ahead and stand up. Stand up again. Let's give them a round of applause. Wait a minute. You're telling me. Let's count together. Can we count together, y'all? One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Seven students mm -hmm. from Mississippi mm -hmm. got scholarships offers yes, to come sir. to Harris Stowe State University. Absolutely, scholarship offers today. Today, uh -huh. right here. Are y'all okay with that? Y'all don't give, give it, give it back, give it back. Are y'all okay with that? Yes, sir. Oh my God. What do you say? What do you say? We're okay with that. It's Harris Stowe State University. Guess what? They know where it's at, and you too can know where it's at. All you got to do is do what the president said do. What's the website? www.hssu.edu. It's a great day to be a Hornet, and change happens here. Okay? <laughs> okay. It is Mr. Gary the King of Hospitality. We are here with all the students from Mississippi, and everybody is winning. Can you all say winning? Winning. Oh my God, listen, it's all about a day of college. It's all about a day of coming. It's all about possibilities. You know a little bit about possibilities. What's your name? Zashanti Brooks. 
Say it again. Zai Ashanti Brooks. Hello, how are you doing? I'm welcome, to, welcome. You? To, I'm good. Welcome to St. Louis. <laughs> Something very special happened to you today. What was it? I got a scholarship. You got a scholarship? Girl, what you know about a scholarship? <laughs> what kind of scholarship did you get? You forgot, <laughs> but you just know you got a scholarship. That's all I don't know. Okay. I got too happy and I forgot. You got too happy and you forgot. Who's over here? Aaliyah Bridges. Aaliyah, tell me what you get. I got a post scholarship. Oh my God! Wow! 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 Now, what do you want to do when you finish high school? You want to go to college? And... I do. I want to major in cosmetology. Cosmetology. Okay, fantastic. Who's over here? Clay Taylor. Okay, Clay. What'd yeah. you get? Scholarship. Okay, for what? What do you want to do? I'm gonna be going to school for the agriculture. Farming and agriculture. Wow, wow, wow. Who's over here? Mercedes Bradford. Did you get much Mercedes? A car? Scholarship. A no, scholarship. scholarship. Okay, what do you want to do? Nursing. Nursing. Great, great. Who's over here? Deja Walker. Deja, what'd you get? A scholarship. Okay, what are you going to be doing? Forensic science. Forensic scientist. I love it, I love it. What about you? Candy James. Candy, what'd you get? A scholarship. So what are you going to be doing? I'm going to major in business. In business. Yeah. I love it, I love it. Who's over here? Jordan Bradley. And what you get? A scholarship. What you gonna be doing? Major in business and entrepreneurship. Um, business and entrepreneurship. You understand what I'm saying? This is why change happens here. And it happens at Harris Stowe State University. I'm so excited to be a part of the young minds, the young people from Mississippi coming and saying, you know what? St. Louis kind of got it going on, kind of got it going on strong. What do you think about Harris Stowe? You've seen the campus, you're walking around. What kind of feeling are you getting? Tell me what you're feeling. I'm excited. You're excited? Well, good. You don't look excited. Show me some excitement. <laughs> Come on, I'm excited. Show me some excitement. Show me a little something. Do something. Something. Show me an exciting kind of move. What you thinking? I'm excited. I want to see them still. You want to see? You want, I want to see them still? Want to see them still? Still. Yeah. Oh, God, God. What, is, what is going on? Let me tell you something. They step in, they walk in, they run in, but they're coming for education. What do you say? What do you say? It's Mr. Gary the King. I'm with the Mississippi students. They're here, and it's all about the education because we do know education rules the nation. Okay? <laughs> okay. What do you say? What do you say? It's Mr. Gary the King. Hospitality. Breaking news. This just in. I need you to meet me at the carnival. That's right. You say, Mr. Gary, how's it a carnival that's going over? Because guess what? It's a carnival that's going over and it's going on. It is in Mid River Mall. It's across the bridge. I need you to get the kids together. You all come over and have a great time. What do you say? What do you say? I'm gonna be looking for you. Okay. <laughs> okay. Get your business in order. Hey, listen, right now I'm walking, I'm walking straight ahead. You know what? We all are gonna end up at a pearly gate someday. I believe that in my heart. Some of you all are not prepared. You're not prepared. You want me to tell you why? Because you keep saying it's never gonna happen to me. I need you to go over and see my friends at William C. Harris, funeral directors. You know why? Because it is gonna happen. And it's gonna happen to you. How prepared are you gonna end up in? Whatever you need to end up doing, you need to make sure you get your business in order. Stop with all this GoFundMe account. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Go fund yourself. Stop waiting for someone to die. And if you can't afford to die, then stop dying. See Harris Funeral Directors. Please give them a call. And most of all, get your business in order. Go fund yourself. Okay? What do you say? What do you say? It is a graduation kind of day. Change happens here if you are a graduate, if you are supporting a graduate here at Harris Stowe State University. Make some noise! Yeah. Yeah. Let me tell you all, this is what it's all about. It's about college. It's about education. But guess what? It's about young black men doing y'all yeah. things. Because guess what they say? They say y'all supposed to be out on the streets robbing people. They say y'all supposed to be carjacking people. They say y'all supposed to be in your mama's basement and don't want a job. But guess what? Y'all saying something different. What y'all saying? What you saying? Most of all, we graduate. Most of all, we graduate. We graduate. We graduate. We graduate. Who graduating today? Me, sir. What, what's, what's, what's your name, sir? My name is Darius Washington. Well, could you tell me, Darius Washington, what you graduating with? Uh, business administration with the emphasis on marketing. Oh my God, what, you gonna, what kind of business you want? I want a marketing firm and oh. also photography as well. Oh my yeah. God, look at her, check. What's up, what's over here? This is Jason Posley checking in. Uh -huh. Graduate from Maryville University. I'm on the second degree now, you feel me? 
Webster University. All right. The bachelor's in health science, you know. All right. I'm going to run a hospital one, one day. You're going to run a hospital? Yes, sir. Now, when you run it, tell me how you're going to run it. You're going to run it fast? You're going to run it slow? Or are you going to run it straight up the middle? I'm going to run it the right way. Oh, my God. The alpha way. The alpha hey, way. Hey, listen, who's over here? Who we got over here? What's up? It's more Keith Evans checking in. Okay. Graduate of Harris Stowe. Graduate State of Harris Stowe. Bachelor's of Psychology. Can I ask you a question? What's they say on? at Harris Stowe, change happens here. Is that true? Did yes. Harris Stowe change you around? Most definitely. Most definitely. Definitely, most definitely. Alpha man, I'm seeing over here the Chris. What's, What's your you name? Doing? Orville James Parker the third. Okay, is that like Orville popcorn? You got some popcorn? Nah, 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 what nah. What you nah. got? Huh? So I got a bachelor's degree yeah. in communication studies with focus conversion media. Oh, that's what's going on, yeah. man. Missouri Baptist University. All right, congratulations. Yes, sir. How you doing? My name is Kyle Dixon. I currently still attend Harrisville State University where I'm studying business administration business with a concentration in marketing. What year? Uh, junior. A junior yep, year. Going into senior year, yes, sir. See, I'm telling you all what you see, I understand this is about education. This is where it starts, this is where it ends. You see so many different ones from different schools, different universities. This is about supporting, supporting education. Maybe they didn't go to the college you wanted them to go to. Parents, I'm talking to you right now. Someone is saying that that's not where I want them to go to school at. It's her choice. It's his choice. The most important thing is, remember, once you get it up here, can't nobody take it away from you, can they? Absolutely not. Oh, my God. What's your name? Danielle Powell or Coach Powell. Oh, my God. Coach Powell. Yes, sir. Man, you're saying your, your, your students graduate. What does this mean? It's, it, they do, they're coming in to do what they're doing. They're you know, scholars, they're graduating, especially the A5 way. All right. But I'm the director of athletic marketing and development, so we, we, uh, we make it happen here at Harris Stowe. I tell you what, Harvest State University, change happens here, okay? <laughs> okay. We are on the campus of Harris Stowe State University. Change happens here. HBCU, historically black college university. I tell you what I'm loving about today. So many family members, so many community members, so many people that make this thing go for the graduates. What's your name? Jennifer. Jennifer, what is this all about today for you? Man, it's it's about possibilities come into fruition. Yeah. Those that were undermined walking across that stage today and they earned it and they worked their butts off for it and this community has helped them through it and will continue to help them oh afterwards. Oh my God, it's about yes. music. You Absolutely. came here today to volunteer your time. Yeah. Why? Why? I, you know, working with the students here at Harris though, this is the biggest reward ever. Oh, wow. so when they finally get to walk across that stage, right. it's so All rewarding. Right. It's about the reward. It's about you being here to see to it. Everything is looking good been good and you in uniform oh, yeah. but the turn up is real because these parents these grandparents man what's your name hey I'm, I'm James officer Greer officer Greer what is this about for you today uh just about the safety safety yeah how important is safety on a day like this hey you see how everything's everything's safe <laughs> because you know what then you got everybody screaming and hollering they want to go up to the stage they want to see this one they want to see a walk what's your name Jada Jada the turn up is real. Is it yes, real, it Jada? Is. Yes, it Take is. Take us to school, Jada. What okay. high school did you go to, first of all? Pattonville High School. Pattonville? Yes. Why did you choose Harris Stowe? First and foremost, I wanted to be around my people. So I wanted to be on a foundation where it correlates with African American educators. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Now, what was your major? Psychology and neuroscience. Okay, okay. Psychology and general science, right? Neuroscience. Right, right. Oh, neuroscience. Ooh, well, look at you. <laughs> now, today it all came down to this. Is it what you thought it was going to be? This day, is it what you thought it would be? Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. I yeah. felt it in my spirit. You feel yes. it in your spirit. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I'll tell you what we feel in that spirit. We feel in that spirit that if you are watching this show right now, and if you think that you got young people who are graduating and they need to babysit your kids, you got it wrong. You the one who had the kids, it's time for you to pay a babysitter or babysit your own kids. These young people are going, they're graduating from high school, and they should be able to go do what they do. They should be able to get out there, get an education. Don't hold them back. Don't make the decision for them. Don't say, I need you to stay at home. Don't say you got to go here, right? What you got to do is, even if they are staying locally, consider her as though. They got the dormitories. Let them get out. Let them start. Learning. Is this yours? Yes, sir. Okay, let me see. Open it up. I want to see well, if you really my, earned it. My, my Open it up. Not in here yet. Oh, it ain't. Stop. <laughs> stop. You see, you tricking me. You tricking me, girl. You up and talk about you got to stop, yet. girl. Stop it. What do you say? What do you say? It's Mr. <laughs> Gary. Stop trying to trick me. Talk about she got her education. <laughs> we got your yet. people, y'all. Okay. Okay. What do you say? What do you say, it's Mr. Gary? I'm here at the Empire. Barbers, beauticians, and stylists, too. I'm waiting for you because you know what to do. Get in, get in, bring your card, and save.
Guess what? Is the Clippers? Is the Shears? Maybe it's lashes too. Whatever it is, it's the Empire Beauty. We want to let you know if you're a stylist, beautician, or barber, we're waiting on you. Okay? <laughs> okay. Bomberdo Automotive Group wants to buy your car and will pay more than anyone else. Just celebrating our 50th year in business, we're the biggest and best in St. Louis. We are a thousand employees strong. And once again, named St. Louis is number one choice for all their automotive needs. We want your vehicle or are willing to pay. Sell your car, truck, or SUV to Bomberito. Not only will we pay the most, but we will give you a $500 Visa gift card at the time we purchase. Visit any location or Bomberito.com. A better experience, a better price. Bomberito, Missouri's number one automotive... What do you say what he says, Mr. Gary the King of Hospitality? I do hope that you are enjoying the show. It's all about the graduation, because the turn up is real. We're right here and we're in the quadrangle, and you see Alpha Phi Alpha, Alpha Kappa Alpha, Delta Sigma Theta, Sigma Gamma, we're all, well, well, well guess what, guess what? You see we are not alone. We've got the uh, Phi Beta Sigmas, we got Omega Psi Phi, uh, Iotas, we got them all. And you know what they're all on today? It's education. We hope that when you watch the show tonight, you may be a person that's wanting to go to college because you want to step. You may be wanting to go to college because you want to have a brotherhood, a sisterhood. You may go to college because you want an education. Education does definitely re rule the nation. And here at Arizona State University, change does happen here. Today is the first, the beginning for changing for all the graduates. But what about you? What about you? What about your students at home? What about your children? What about the ones that are in kindergarten? Understand, education starts from when they start talking. Education starts when they're gonna be paying attention to what you say. But education starts with supporting. You may be a person that is a parent. You may be a person that is a grandparent, an uncle, an aunt, a friend. You just need to support the young people when they're on education again and again. So what do you say, what he says, Mr. Gary, the King of Hospitality? I got your people in the spirit of education, okay? <laughs> okay. What do you say, what do you say? I do not write the material for the show, but I think I got who? Riley Barnes. And who do I have over there? And his beautiful mother, Robin Riley Barnes. Okay, now you're trying to give your mama some directions, and your mama's saying she don't care if you're the graduate, she's still the mama. I, what is that about? I, I don't know. I got my degree. It's supposed to be my day. She won't even listen to me. She won't even listen to I, you? I don't know what's going on. I told her to take the mask off. Uh-huh, right, uh, but she was like, guess what? I'm keeping my mask on. Right, she paid the bills. I still live with her, so I... <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Let me tell you something. For all those who paid the bill for the turn-up, because the turn-up was real, for all of you all who stuck with the graduates, for all of you all who saw to that they walked across that stage, Mama, how you feeling today? I feel wonderful. Yeah, I'm yeah. so proud. This is my firstborn. Yeah. And I'm just proud. I'm You're really proud. proud. Overwhelmed. Okay. Proud. How you feel, man? Looking at I your mom. Know. I just. I'm happy to see her happy. Yeah. As long as she's smiling, I'm smiling. We came oh, a long way. That's all, man. Long way. You all have come a long way, graduates. It is your time. It is your day. It's time for you. If you are a senior and you graduate. Stand up, step up. If you're a senior at college, a senior at high school, whatever you are doing. But just remember, nobody likes a dummy. Nobody likes a dummy, is that right? That's right. I mean, what advice do you have to everybody graduating this year from high school? Um, you can do it. It's, it, 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 it yeah. Come to Harris Stowe, change happens here, like they say. Sure, you can do it for sure. Oh my God, well I tell you what we want y'all to do. We want you to do like Betty Thompson said. We want you to wake up. We want you to get up. We want you to dress up. We want you to be up. We want you to pay up. And if you can't do all that, then just shut up. <laughs> what do you say when he says, Mr. Gary, I got you graduates, okay? <laughs> okay. Wait, wait, wait. So exactly how much is a lot a lot? It's a lot a lot, like a lot a lot. Like show me everything you got a lot. Like a lot of bang for a little buck, like a filet for the price of chop, like a short stack that's a mile high or lasagna. Pile to the sky, it's a lot of something that'll make you smile and a lot of good to keep you shopping right. So grab a friend and take a bite. You might just find it's a lot to like. Hey, that's a lot a lot. Save a lot a lot. It's a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot. What do you say? What do you say? It's Mr. Gary the King of Hospitality. There's a new sheriff in town, and he's not clowning around. And his name is Holla Day, and her name is N. And they're in West County at 270 and Olive Street Road in West County. This is the spot, you all. Do you want a good place that gets customer service? They got it. Do you want a good place that gets you your food and it's delicious and hot? They got it. Do you want a good place? Do you need to come and bring all of your catering needs? 
They got it. What about a good place for your meetings? They got it. What about a good place to have your wedding receptions? They got it. What about that ball? What about that bar mitzvah? What about that gala? They got it. But what about attention to detail? They got it. They nailed it. It's none other than the Holiday Inn. So you need to stop chilling and thinking about the Holiday Inn, or you need to get in here and let the party begin. What do you say? What do you say? It's Mr. Gary the King of Hospitality. Guess what? Holiday Inn, West County, 270, and Olive Street Road. Check, check, check. They got it. It is always great to be around the people who are doing things, not just in school, out of school, around the community, around the churches, around the neighborhood. I know some people just like that, and they're known, they're referred to affectionately because they know what they do. And they're not just the AKAs, because some of you all say AKAs. They're not Alpha, Kappa, Alpha. They are the ladies of, you ready? <laughs> alpha, Kappa, Alpha. So Royalty Incorporated. Oh my God, I got the AKAs up in here. Well, we're really outside, so we're out in here, out of here. Make some noise, ladies. Woo! Sounds so good to me. <laughs> Let me tell you something. If you don't know, Alpha Kappa Alpha has a history with St. Louis. Why? Because our founder was born here. Oh my God, right here in St. Louis, Missouri. Yes. <laughs> right here representing and went on to represent all over. What's your name? Kaylin Taylor Hawkins. Okay, Miss Kayla Taylor Hawkins, what's your major name, girl? What's your Biology. Major? Ooh, is there a doctor in the house? What you gonna do with that? I wanna be a pediatrician. Oh my God, wonderful, wonderful. Who's over here? Dr. Martin Berry. Dr. Martin, when you see these young people mm -hmm. and you see the journey and you see that they're members of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority, this is what it's supposed to be about. Is absolutely, that right? Absolutely, absolutely. The future is bright. The future is bright. And pretty. And pre oh, well, I guess what? How bright is your future? How pretty is your future? Well, I tell you what, if you're one of these ladies of Alpha Kappa Alpha and you're pink and green, you know to whom much is given, much is required. What's required of the people? Well, you have to be a scholar. Yeah. You have to do community service. Yeah. And you have to be pretty. Oh. <laughs> and it seems like somebody is the birthday princess, yes, too. Yes, I am. Oh, my God. What's your degree? What's your degree? Biology pre-med. Oh, my God. Another doctor's in the house. Yes, pediatric oh. dermatology. Oh, well, look at this. Who's over here? I'm Trinity Cole Reed. Okay, Trinity, uh, tell us about you. Um, major in uh, biology pre-medicine, future what is, neonatologist. What is going on over all these doc What? Is this what Alpha Kappa Alpha is on? It is. Oh, my God. Being the first and the finest. The first and the finest. The first and the finest. And the finest. What's going on with you? You better not say you know Dr. Girl. What's up? <laughs> um, what's your name? My name is Skylar, uh -huh. and my major is biology pre-med, and I'm going to be a pharmacist. Let me tell y'all something. It's education, and it goes down just like this. So you know what? You may see the ladies of Alpha Kappa Alpha and the other sorority stepping, marching, doing their thing, representing. You know what? But it's just like my question for you today. You may be stepping, marching, doing your thing, but what is your thing, really? Who are you trying to help? What journey are you on? Who are you trying to bring along? I tell you what, it's the ladies of Alpha Kappa Alpha. A shout out right now to Miss Glenda Glover. Y'all know a Glenda Glover. you Madame Supreme. Is that what it is? And a shout out to your former regional director right here in St. Louis, Miss Kathy Walker Steele. For all you do, the ladies of Alpha Kappa Alpha, this is for you. Okay? <laughs> okay.